is going on guys Matt374 here and today we are back with The Walking Dead a new frontier uh, episode 4 thicker than water this is part 2 um so we just had a flashback with Kenny um and uh when Clementine lost AJ I still find it shocking that in a month she lost Kenny she, Kenny died and AJ was taken off her. It's mind blowing that, that all that happened in a month. Like, you know, y y she's lost two people she loved, and uh, but, but I I'm surprised that. Well, it probably did destroy her. She's still going, but for me, that I just I couldn't I wouldn't be able to cope with that sort of shit, right? I'm I'm like nah. No, just lost two people I loved in a month. I'm out. <laughs> uh, well, I'd keep living, obviously, but wouldn't know how to uh, to handle that. But enough of me rambling. Let's get straight back into it. So we left it off with um with Lingard Hello, just waking up. Javier, thought you were rotting in a cell with David. Any chance he got out too? Oh, he is drugged up. I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Joan took him before I got out. I haven't seen him since. That poor bastard. He's. He's not getting out. Guess there's only one sure way to get away from Joan these days. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up. Took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a wow. good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than, than he's ever been. <sighs> you can be as mad as you want. About how, about how things pan out. AJ belongs with family Clem and family, family only. No kid is better off when you break their family apart. Maybe you're right. Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? Yeah, no shit. What do you want? I... I just want to die. <laughs> I want you to inject this into me. Uh, Hang in there. Tomorrow's another day. I, I can't. Yeah, but what when if if we found, inject you? He, if we inject you with that to, to kill you, everything I'd given do up. Do you tell us where AJ is? My life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. He's Without got big around, hands. I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. Huh? Wait. Oh wait, so I would just kill him whole refuse. We're, we're refusing then. Do it yourself. I'm sorry, Clem, we can't do this. No, I have to. If you won't, I will. Clem, stop. He's not in his right mind. You can't do this. <laughs> Let go of me. I'm taking the deal. We'll find AJ, just not this way. Oh. There is no other way. Where is you can consider oh. the deal. Oh. Oh. No. Javi. 
Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, so oh. It's your funeral. I was not listening. Especially now. Now that Jones rounding up all alleged traitors. You better hope she doesn't find you. Oh. Hey, Oh, I'm oh. sorry, Clem. I hey. didn't. I didn't know that. I. Uh, Hi, Clementine. I thought. Surprised to see you here. <sighs> yeah. I never right, heard him mention you. once. I'll tell you where AJ you is. Good? Yeah. Uh, We're if you set. inject me Let's or roll. something along the lines of that, I must have completely mm. missed hard. Good to see you. Trophy earned. Blood for blood. That is chapter four completed. Javi, you're back. And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. Just surprised to see you is all. Oh, hell. You okay? Yeah. It looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. I saved this one for you. No, I've already got one. Well, two one, huh? Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. Yeah. Thanks. What took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. It's got to be a stressful job. Looking after an entire community? He was definitely not 100% there. That's for sure. Sounds about right. Oh, I'm sorry, Clam. Why don't you go talk to Kate? Okay? Oh, yeah, she needs to okay. talk. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Jones people know we're holed up here, and they're going to come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just because they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. I know, I know. We're fucked, okay? Oh, thanks for that, Javi. Like we don't know that already? We can't just cut and run. Not with the herd out there. Like it or not, Definitely not. we're fucking stuck in Richmond. How the fuck are we going to put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. I mean, can't you have people so, upon roofs how do and we just do that? take her out there? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. We move in fast, guns blazing, and we take her out. Couple of bullets, problem solved. After we take Joan out, we're going to need some way out of this mess. I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one, that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are going to be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but... Well, it looks well, like the walkers the are coming from there, Evo. That's a bit risky. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, you're bleeding right through that bandage. Uh, it was Gabe's fault. As soon as you got in. It was Gabe's fault. Why don't you ask him what happened out there? I was just doing what had to be done. I'm the one who tells you what to do, not the other way around. We got it stitched up. It's fine. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, <laughs> can you take a look at this? As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. But would you guys stop making such the, a big deal about it? The bandage it is on it, it's so over. how can you look Move at it? Already. I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. Oh, I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just no. give me a gun and I'll do whatever. Let the grown-ups come up with a plan. Okay, Gabe? 
Because yours is going to be so much better than mine. Whatever. Who's to say you're even coming along, kid? Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, you're oh, not this coming. This is bullshit. I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. That's literally the reason why you'll stay behind. Dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there. And I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save Dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than anyone else. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. Could you do me a favor and stop showing off for everybody? You're tough, okay? You can handle a lot of shit. You don't have to prove it all the goddamn time. Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Oh. Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to Yeah, we're calling him a little prick. You little fucking asshole! You don't scare me. You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, man. He had a gun on him. If I hadn't killed him, he was going to shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger, no question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made we sure of that. We don't really care about Conrad Looks anyway. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better Fine off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out, and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We can take care of ourselves. Fuck off. All of you. If you don't think I fucking agonized about it, then you can all go to hell. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Where the fuck's Gabe going? <gasps> really, she said he's staying behind. Clem, you come with me to get the truck. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? <laughs> Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. No, you're not. You stay behind and keep watch. You proved your fucking point already, Gabe. Now it's time to grow up and help us. Hey, Gabe. Come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah. Okay. Clem, this is not helping. Somebody needs to be a lookout. What? Nothing. Dave <laughs> and I will be fine back here. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, that definitely looks very secure. Uh, I want to go talk to Clem. Oh, oh, Harvey's sliding again. What's going on? Thanks. For what? What? Helping out with Gabe. He's out of oh. time. Oh, she was telling him to stay back. Yeah, okay. We all are. I'm just doing what I can. Let's keep looking for that truck. Well, if he doesn't listen to me, he'll listen to Clem. Well, yeah, look, there's, there's the truck. And Harvey's still sliding. <laughs> there it is. Let's go. What 
the chances? I'd say about 50-50. Of course it is. Ah, would you look at that? Smart ass. Oh, shit. We've got company. Okay, I did press down. What? Why are they this. just walking in? Come on, we gotta hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we gonna do? We can't start the engine. Not without attracting a lot of attention. Katie, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get well, behind the truck and push. If it's an old if armored truck, some distance between us and then them. it's bulletproof. And that means the windows are also bulletproof. So you could technically start it in there. And be completely fine. Ready? Ready. Ready. And I'm definitely sure an armor truck is not that easy to push, especially with three people behind it. Turns out you needed me after all, huh? Oh, shut up, Gabe. I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. Just push the damn truck. All right. What do you think I'm doing? I'm doing all the work. You're the one trying to have a conversation here. That's more like it. <laughs> oh, that is literally me. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Well, yeah, Kate, it has to be neutral in order to push it. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? What's in the box? Well, we're going to take the wire cutters over a hammer. Oh, shit. Looks like we did need the hammer. Or not. Oh, no, he grabbed both. Okay. Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Uh, maybe you should be in the truck? Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay, here goes. Oh, you did need the hammer. Wire cutter should help with this. Gotta connect the battery to the ignition. Uh, right, okay. So... Uh, it's gonna be... These two, then? Let there be light. Oh. I knew that wasn't going to hold. Oh, shit. Well, it's them two, then. Don't get electrocuted. Abby, hurry up. Well, everyone, get Let's in. Go. Now. There also is not a door on that. Trophy earned. Smoke and fire. That is chapter five done. So we are in the last chapter of this episode. The square is a couple of blocks away. 
This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? Well, I'm not about to turn the engine off again. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. <sighs> That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really takes you back, doesn't it? Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. You're right. This is nice. If I just close my eyes, we're right back where we were. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff. Not everything that happened after. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. He light likes her. You get it? Kind of amazing, huh. isn't it? That in the middle of all this, they find time to flirt with each other. Guess it just goes to show. You stick two people together, something's going to happen between them. I'm just glad it's the good kind of something this time around. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet, but to feel something that intensely for another person, when I was his age and I liked the girl, I was a fucking wreck. <laughs> Sweaty palms and stomach aches. And... Boners behind math books? We knew. <laughs> Every time, we knew. See? Hell on earth. It's unfair, that's all I'm saying. That they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and... When that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. <sighs> I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. That's why we're doing this thing, right? So he can have a better life after everything's said and done? You're right. I know you're right. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time... That's what made the difference. Oh? You're so sure of... What you're doing all this for you didn't run away i'm here so i can set an example for people for gabe especially someone to be proud of someone who might be an arsehole but he's still gotta uh, be the example there's no graceful way to say this so i'm just gonna say it i know we've had moments you and i i knew this was coming and there are always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all <laughs> but before whatever happens tomorrow happens i need you to know whatever this thing is between us i want to give it a chance even though and I you're know now the back fact with that david is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated but do you feel the same way i'd really like to know yeah we're Let's saying yes straight away we gotta try right oh my god really really so are we gonna <laughs> okay yeah shit we're doing this you do realize we're going to have to have a weird conversation with David, right? <laughs> it's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. That would be the stand-up thing to do in this situation. Can I just say how lame doing the stand-up thing is, though? Oh, it's super lame. Javi, it's an execution over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. Oh, oh great. Now, don't bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square. Shit. We gotta get over there. Now. I'm 
going to hang back here, with the truck. Keep the walkie close by. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Good luck. Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Yeah. Like, is the whole plan shot? Or did she just have a little setback? Ava could be having problems with the walkie-talkie. Maybe it's out of range, or ran out of batteries or something. Maybe. We're not gonna know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. You ready? Ready as I'm gonna be. Glad to hear it. Okay. Oh, there's David. Maybe they shouldn't be standing in the crowd. For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. But, unfortunately, the actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all She's in... She's lying to all of you! I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. Oh. Oh, yeah. Cover, uh, cover Badger's head up. I saw him murder Lonnie with my own eyes. Some of the best well, technically, we killed knew. Badger and Max. Down in their prime. He this killed Lonnie. We want in charge. Someone this reckless. This cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. I knew Joan was willing to fight dirty, but this is taking it to the next level. We gotta be ready to match her game. I think you're right. Javier! I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why did you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have to say. Happy to. Been waiting for this all day. Then I'll try not to disappoint you. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't Excuse that right, me? Eleanor? We did. She said you were coming here today to take me out. Wow. Add to your total. Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off. And that's exactly what I'm planning to do. Appreciate the honesty. Which makes this so much harder. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. Oh shit, they got Trip and Ava. Oh no, they had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really hey, it wasn't you David, it was Ava. Town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here, so I'm going to do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one. Just one. No! Hell no! Don't! Oh. Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. If you're going to punish anyone, it should be me, not them. So ready to sacrifice yourself for others. Don't worry, Javi. I'm not through with you yet. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Right. 
Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Trip. He Boys. was an he was an asshole. Oh wow. Okay. Come on, Harvey. Trip was an asshole last time we spoke to him. Your Ava, friend. though, she's always. Your brother's lieutenant. I I have massive respect for her. She's got balls, and she has military oh, experience. So I'm serious? willing to sacrifice Trip here, and I will save Ava. Let Ava live. She's always been loyal. Hobby. Yeah, she's very loyal. No. Well, yeah, fuck you, Eleanor. Backstabbing, double crossing, no good, dirty fucking murder. Such language. But I admire the sacrifice you're making here, Hobby. Shoot her. Wait! What? I said don't shoot Ava. You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Betrayal. Joan, think about what you're doing. Wow. Ava's one of us. You can't fucking do this. This is fucked. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. Wow. Joan. And he fucking killed her. No! Oh my god. They really shot her. God damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. Ah. <sighs> I can't believe this. This isn't how we do things. This is madness. Stop her, Clint. Is this the process you trusted? No. Think about this, Hobby. You know what's gonna happen here. You ready for that? We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about mm. you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond. And then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody put your guns away. We're going to handle this peacefully. Wow. Don't listen to them, Javi. That is awful. Butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch. Take her out. She deserves it. Ooh. If you don't do it, we I'll could take the deal it. here. Or we shoot Joan. I feel like we should be shooting Joan. She's a bitch. <laughs> She's killed Ava when we chose to save her. Um, She's going to hang David. She's... Well, what else was there? Oh, of course. Attacked communities. So we're shooting her. Oh, right in the eye. Great shot. Dead. Ah, now innocent people are dying. Great. Okay. Shit, almost lost his head. Oh, hello, Troy. You son of a bitch! Get back here! Okay, I need you to cover me. Hang on, David. Right. Clint didn't do anything. Okay. Dad needs us. We gotta get out there. David's trained for this. We're not. You think you'll be okay out there? I've got no doubts. Yeah, Harvey, you could have got shot there. Oh, they're trying to shoot Clem. Shit, I gotta help her. God damn it! Just go. I'll try and cover you. Oh, now you're trying to cover me, Trip. Way out of this hobby. Why did you have to 
go and shoot her. Shit, get down! I hear gunfire. What the hell is going on over there? Are you guys okay? <laughs> we need to get the fuck out of here. Right now. Can you bring the truck over? On my way. Great. Oh, shit. That covered the place, like, really quick. Oh, here she comes. It's Kate. She's coming for us. She's not gonna see Harvey. Oh, shit. Shoot him? No? Oh, God. Oh shit. Oh god. Javi, you've got to get over there before. Oh shit. Uh Jade! Well, she's that done. And here come the walkers. Wow. Episode 4, Thicker Than Water. Trophy earned. The Price of Justice. Chapter 6. Done. <laughs> wow, that's the end of the episode. Um, Did you promise that you would help Kate with the family if David left? You and 91.4% of players promised you'd help Kate. 8.6% didn't? Wow. How did you respond to Dr. Lingard's request? You and 46.3% of players refused to kill Lingard. Wow. I'm on the low side. Shock him. Did you tell Kate that you have feelings for her? You and 78% of players told Kate you shared her feelings. Okay. Who did you try to save at the execution? You and 58.6% of players tried to save Ava. Yeah, if anyone's thinking the same as me it was she has experience in military and all that stuff she knows more of richmond than us so it was better keeping her alive but guess not did you shoot joan or take clint's deal you and 56.6 percent of players chose to shoot joan wow and that's it guys that's um that's the end of the episode. Of course, it is uh, going to put us straight into the next one. But we will leave it. Whoops. Right. Uh, that was a very good episode, that. Um, we hopefully got to see Kenny one more time um I don't think it's not the last time but I I have that feeling it is the last time um Joan's dead Ava's dead uh did anyone else die oh potentially Kate um David's alive Clint's alive so we've pretty much just ended our war with Joan well no we have ended our war with Joan uh killing her so yeah uh and now we just we have episode five left uh to do from the gallows so uh over the next quarter of days I still have uh one video to go out I should have one video up now um I still have one more video to go up and two uh two more which will be uh uh episode four so you know this will um uh i i've got my week plans pretty well i mean that's it's perfect for a for a 
Well, actually, no. Uh, technically, the video goes up on a Monday, as it's Monday now. So, I have all my uploads through to Thursday, which is great. Um, and I finished uh, college. Uh, I finished college on Wednesday for a week, which is uh, pretty good. So, that means... Um, you know, we've got like a week and a half there to hopefully smash out The Walking Dead, any uh, RTG content, uh, and what have you. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, don't forget to turn on this post notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next video I do. Peace.